to a new reaction video. My name is Larissa and today I'm going to react to the new episode of American Horror Stories. I'm actually quite excited about this because these are constantly new stories and actually yesterday I realized that the new episode was coming out today and I was just like, oh, I'm so excited to see what the story is gonna be about this time. There's just something about these little stories I really like and um, I think it's just mostly the excitement knowing what it's about this time and just finding something out in a small amount of time. Uh, because mostly I just watch full length TV shows and I know I love that but this is something new it's refreshing like I said uh, last time and I'm not saying these episodes are freaking masterpieces or anything but I am really enjoying it and as long as you're enjoying a story and enjoying a movie or TV show and it's fine, right? I actually also don't watch any trailers, even though I see them when I scroll on Instagram. I see those trailers and I'm like, okay, I'm so curious what the next episode is going to be about. But also, I just want it to be a full surprise. So I'm not going to watch it. So right now, I just totally have no idea what it's going to be about. If you want to see my reaction to this episode uncut, you can check out my Patreon. The link is in the description and uh, you would also support my channel with that. So if you want that, the link is in the description and you can check that out. And now I'm going to react to this one. So let's go. Only rule is bro rule. And who are we? Zoom. Wyatt. James. Barry. We're gonna do better. This looks like some kind of intro for a YouTube channel. Yeah. What's up, everybody? Okay. It's in uh, 26. No limits, no boundaries. That's just the way we roll out here. I mean, the crazier the better. I'm gonna do what everyone else is doing. Before I was an influencer, I was pre-med. Uh, I could have been your doctor. Good morning. Are you ready for your breast exam? Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> yo, yo, I'm very. <laughs> These guys are so I'm cringy. I, I mean, I wouldn't trade it for anything. The drinking, the party, the girls, definitely. The girls. And you make money with it, so who wouldn't want that? Honestly, five days till Christmas. I'm very curious what this is gonna be about. Ba so okay. this was a good intro. Okay. So I know who they are. I know what's going on. Dude, if I look like that, I'd want to jump too. Maybe we should call the police. They never get here in time. The dude's ready to fly. Then we can't just sit. Why are you so excited cameras. about that? Dude, 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 come on, come on. Let's go. Get the camera on him. We've been here sixty. How can you be this awful? What's up, everybody? It's your boy Zen. I'm here with Wyatt, James, and Barry. You guys are not gonna believe this. This I hate them already. I already did, but... And we are here to see it. <laughs> now will he have the balls? Bro house! Bro house! Bro house! Bro house! Bro house! Bro house! And they're filming with their cell phone? Oh my god. You're a fucking influencer. You have a YouTube channel that goes so well and you don't even have a camera. Guys, we can't actually. Posts. No, you can't. Why not? You'll get cancelled. His body landed over there somewhere. Oh we my god. Come, come on, come on, come on. James? That's right. Come on, baby. But these guys are so fucking dumb. But I mean. Oh, new intro, yes. Nothing against influencers because some of them are actually doing some pretty good shit But there are just a lot of dumb ones And they're one of those people Is it something about a Santa stalker? I don't know man, I, I don't like this intro as much as the previous ones But you see that they really did it in the way like they posted it on a story <laughs> It's it's a new idea, a new thing, and yeah, we'll see. Yeah, I was thinking about Logan Paul too. Yeah, you kind of are. Yeah, you are. <laughs> An idiot. A big idiot. This is not gonna work out well says we've done another 50,000 followers maybe you're reading it wrong I didn't like the jumper I'm too afraid to read it I didn't yeah, no fucking it. shit and this petition on change.org to have our channel shut down it gets worse the dead man's family is holding a press conference this afternoon to denounce us yeah as they shoot we gotta go get what 
homosexual. That's it. Yeah, it's like a movement or something transcending heterosexual norms. Yeah, I heard about chicks digging when guys are like affectionate and stuff. Who the fuck told you that? Hetero guys acting gay, saying gay shit, but all the time they're not gay. All you gotta do is say no homo after you do something, and then you're cool. <laughs> That's so not cool. I hate them, okay? Gays, LBTRs, it's harmful. Hurtful. What the hell? No way. Uh, wait. Excuse me? Uh, what are you doing? Hey! company said they suspended your contract and they sent us to collect the promotional materials, including this and the Lamborghini. Look at all I'm gay. I just can't believe how fucking dumb these guys are. They're just such morons. Seriously? I don't know what I'm watching. Yeah, I'm just getting on the record, okay? My dad watched this shit, yo. No homo. One, two. I actually don't believe any of them is straight. Oh, Oh, I don't, um, Honestly, it just kind of looks like they went crazy after getting that backlash. Yeah, I get that. I'm not even dirty and my life is over. Maybe actually start doing something with your life. It's also actually kind of disturbing to see some dudes who are all almost 30 years old being so childish they're acting like they're 16 years old with their bro house stuff now it's getting interesting that will probably be killer santa or something have you been naughty or nice i've been Santa's bringing us this year. So we're the bro house. We were wondering, what is it like being an elf? Uh, fine, I guess. Do you get like half pay or something like that because you're half science? <laughs> <laughs> Santa's bringing us this year. So we're the bro house. We were wondering, what is it like being an elf? Uh, fine, I guess. <laughs> is it true what they say about male elves? What? That they're hung like reindeer. Oh, guys. <laughs> no, <laughs> guys. Does Santa get first pick on elf chicks? What? You know, like, uh, are you his little uh, helper? Okay, you guys need to be uh, We're just trying to have Christmas fun. We're just trying to have some. The worst thing is that there are, there, that there are actually guys who are like that. Wait, 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 wait. Are you guys like I'm watching this now and I'm like I can't imagine people being this stupid, but those people exist. This is a public service announcement. Oh, Santa isn't real. It's just your parents. Yeah, they're the ones who bring you your toys. Yeah. I know, it's a bummer. No, right, Santa, baby. Leave now. I just really want Why something bad to happen to them. Shit. Just Work. kill them, man. Just kill them. And film it. Put it online. You get what you deserve. <laughs> <laughs> That's really annoying Christmas hat and that other thing. Great. Whatever, man. Bro, I'm so fat, baby. Wait, people like that? Or humiliate a little person or tell a bunch of kids that Santa Claus isn't real. Okay, so things got a little crazy. And then you decide to you know, still upload it. Making up for mm -hmm. cheering. If you don't like how we roll, maybe you're not bro house material. Yeah, get out of that while you, well, you can. You should. Maybe if it wasn't for your shit, we wouldn't be here. Come on, chill out. The cameraman is literally the only reasonable one. Just when I thought the bro house couldn't sink any lower, you go and do this. Whatever, man. It's one comment. No, here's some more. This isn't fair. How can you be so mean? Yeah, you're mean. I can't do this. I can't go back to living with my parents. These guys annoy me so much. This is Detective Dina Gibbs calling from L.A. Robbery Homicide. Who am I speaking with? Uh, Zim. I need to speak with you and your friends about the individual who was posing as Santa. It seems he wasn't the man hired for the job. We just found that individual in his apartment. Murdered. Are you serious? Like, this isn't a joke? 
We're pretty sure this isn't the first time you've done this. Oh my god! Yeah, and of course they think this is amazing because they can use this for new content. Because that's the kind of assholes they are. I really hope he makes the perfect video of murdering them all. So I'm just uploaded a video to our account. What do you mean, so? Jesus, what the hell are we watching right now? <laughs> it's a prank. Why is pranking us? Yeah, how? What? Zen? Dude, I'm gonna talk to him. <sighs> so I'm just, just posted a, a link. The hell oh, the other guy. Oh no. Come on, man, it's not cool. Why? He's the biggest asshole. He was a pagan nature god, bringer of storm and fury and destruction, who wore animal skins and a hideous painted face. He was also a fierce hunter who punished those who were bad. Over time, he became what we know of him today. The fuck are you? Yo, where's Why? Are you the one doing this shit with him? No! <laughs> I believe in you! <laughs> Ooh. Yeah, that's what, what it's like when everything is a prank to you. Fear not being severe. Let nothing be the prank. That man is terrifying though. Oh. Always when I when I start watching an episode and people are assholes, I'm like, you really deserve it to get killed. And then they get killed and then I'm like, oh, maybe it's a little bit heavy. You get the fuck out of this house. Wait, wait, wait. We can't just leave the guys. Yeah. If these videos are for real, they're fucking dead. Actually, he, he really didn't do that much bad stuff, the camera guy, I mean. So okay. he actually wanted to stop them. It was a bummer. I know, I just get the fuck out of here, okay? Okay. We knew from the beginning, okay? <gasps> He's literally the only one who's still alive. But this was also quite a short episode, so... <sighs> Poor guy, I honestly didn't want him to die. Yeah, now no one believes you anymore. No fucking way, you are not. <gasps> oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Oh, get the fuck out of there. Get away. Oh. What did we do? Be distracted by that. How? Is he still alive? Definitely not. It must have cost a lot of work. I mean, in the meantime, you would have thought they already got there. But this guy's a professional, obviously. Did I just watch? Um, yeah. Weird episode. At first, I really hated it. 
it was <laughs> so annoying I don't know, these guys were just so annoying and I was just constantly annoyed by them and I think that was actually the meaning what they wanted because then they got killed and I don't know what to think about it right now at this very moment I'm, I'm doubting a bit because at the beginning I was like okay, people were already complaining about these episodes but I honestly like the first three the third one a little less than the first two but I still like those small stories but at the beginning i was like okay this is probably going to be the first episode i i'm not gonna like but at the end i don't know i just liked the Santa twist even though we probably already kind of expected it i already expected it a bit it was also in the in the intro yeah for him to be suddenly in that house and and to upload his videos i think it was really yeah, it, it just had something that the moment he was killing the last guy, they reached 5 million subscribers. And that was basically the thing that it was about this entire episode. So yeah, actually, while I was watching the episode, I already said a lot of things. Because I was just so frustrated with these guys and the things they did and the things that happened. That I just kept screaming my thoughts through it because it just really frustrated me. So I don't really have a lot of other things left to say. Um, other than... I don't know, at the beginning when I saw that this episode was going to be about influencers, I was like, okay, it's it's very much from this time. It's a thing that's very hot right now. But there's also this thing about influencers. People just hate on them. Yeah, how do I say that? People just hate on them like it's normal. Like, oh, someone's an, someone is an influencer, they must be fucking stupid and, and, and assholes and dumb. And But I, I just kind of... I don't really like that stigma around influencers just because I know a lot of influencers who actually put so much work in what they're doing right now and these guys you saw, these are those typical influencers you just have to hate but I also know a lot of influencers and they also say okay I know I am one but I just don't like the name influencer just because people hate so much on it and then I'm like that's, that's kind of sad because I see these people, I mean of course I have a YouTube channel myself so I know it's a lot of work. Look, I just make reaction videos. It's a lot of work. It's so much work. But I just, I can't imagine having to think about doing another video every week to do something original every week and to keep entertaining people. And then people are like, okay, but they don't add anything to society and they're just lazy fuckers who don't want to get a job. Okay, some of them, yes, but there are also a lot of them who just entertain people. And I mean, if you're watching Netflix and there's someone making a movie or a TV show, how is that actually any different from someone who is just making nice YouTube videos for you to enjoy? A lot of people enjoy it and people always say that, that artists are the, the least necessary thing in society, but imagine how depressed everyone would be without artists. That's just kind of what I'm trying to say. And um, that's why I don't really like when people say, oh, I, I hate influencers because they're so annoying. And the typical influencers, they're annoying, but there are just a lot of influencers who just work so hard and do great stuff, actually. That was my rant. <laughs> Talking about these guys, um, they're actually those bad influencers who are fucking annoying. I mean, it's just like the things they did, it was so logical that you shouldn't do that. It was so logical that you just don't do that. You just don't. But they kept doing stupid stuff. And indeed, when you thought it couldn't get more stupid, it, it got more stupid. So I kind of feel like they really wanted us to hate them. So maybe we wouldn't feel too bad when Santa was killing them. I, I, think I really enjoyed seeing Santa kill them in really original ways actually i mean if this really happened i would be like "Ooh, that's fucking terrible i mean these guys they did some bad shit but they didn't deserve it to get killed but when i'm watching a show i'm like yeah kill them be creative so yeah i, I honestly i just really enjoyed that part and also it felt kind of good because you're so frustrated with these guys and then to see them get killed the only one i was kind of sad about was the cameraman because he didn't do that much bad shit he actually he was the one who constantly tried to prevent them from doing the shit but in the end he was the one who uploaded it so he would have had the final call in deciding to upload it or not but you just saw that those other 
uh, guys just had such a big influence on him so he didn't really have much of a choice if he actually wanted to stay there if he actually wanted to stay living there and yeah i just don't really blame him but then in the end when when he was basically full of gasoline and the computer said that they reached 5 million subs and the only thing he could focus on was that they reached 5 million subs while he was literally getting murdered then i was like okay dude then you just maybe it was a shock i'm not sure but maybe you just deserve it too i don't know man so yeah overall I really like the end of the episode. I think it was, I mean, the thing though, Santa, the, the, the Santa was actually the only cool part in this entire episode. I think getting influencers into an episode, I think it's a very big thing that's happening now. So they kind of, kind of want to, yeah, show us now. So yeah, it's, it's trendy now and, and that it's about that. Okay, fine. But honestly, the first. 20 minutes i think at least the first maybe more i, I think like like the last 15 minutes were the good ones but the first 25 minutes i was just watching this like why am i watching this why i just yeah i don't know it's just really not my favorite episode from the season let's just say it like that i don't think it was that good but um in the end, I did like the last 50 minutes. It was kind of hilarious, I think. And uh, yeah, I was just curious what the Santa was going to do next. So I liked the last part, but overall the episode wasn't that good. Yeah, I, I'm, I'm curious to see what story they're going to do next. And uh, every week I'm just excited to see what they're going to do next. So I'll just keep watching. Um, but right now when I'm seeing this episode, I'm kind of starting to get why everyone is being a little bit negative about this show even though i still try to see the good sides of an, of an episode i'm like i'm always very i just have a lot of respect for people who make tv shows and movies and even when it's a really bad movie or a really bad tv show i'm still thinking like okay people actually put a lot of work in this and people actually wanted to make this and they did it and that's already a lot and okay maybe it's not the best thing but people put work in it and yeah then i sometimes just also try to respect those few good things about it and the, and the end was pretty cool especially the christmas tree come on you gotta admit that yeah next week a new episode but the thing is yeah that's next next week um next week i am going on holiday for two weeks uh which means i can't record next week <laughs> so um actually there are going to come out three more american horror stories episodes and um the next two I won't be able to record because I won't be at home. Because I will be in Greece actually. And uh, I'm super excited for that. But that means that I can't uh, record American Horror Stories for two weeks straight. And the week I'll get back, the last one will come out. So that means when I get back in that week, I'll just have three episodes. I can just watch right away. And um, then I'll probably also upload those three in, in that week right away. I'll have some... Um, some other videos I made which I am going to upload in the time I'm not home. So uh, I'll still upload weekly. But then in like two or three weeks um, I'll just upload the rest from this show. So I thought let's just say that in, in case anyone is really hyped for my reactions to the show. And, and you're just wondering like where the fuck is the next American Horror Story. So now you know. Anyway that was it. I hope you even though this episode was kind of terrible. Um, I still hope you like my reaction. I hope I added something fun to it at least. And um, yeah, then I hope you like my video. If you did, leave a like, subscribe. And um, yeah, that was it. Now I feel like an influencer. <laughs> okay, <laughs> bye.